Hello, this is BC Stifler here with another How to Build It Star Wars. Today I'm going to be showing you how to build the sput custom, my custom Sputter Droid D2 and the turret. First, we're going to start off with the Sputter Droid D2. Okay, first thing is you're going to need a flat circle piece like that, two of these pieces with it connecting them, and then a piece like this connected to it. So, like that. Next you want to take a piece like this. By the way, just for this spider droid, I think you're only you're only gonna need one of these. I thought there would be I thought there was more. Attach it on here like that. And then take a piece like this. There you go like that slant and put it up like that. Then next you want to take a it can be um a flat square. I have a flat circle on there. A piece with one hole and another piece with two holes with two of these pegs in it. You want to set the one hole like that and the two pegs with on the back here. You want to take here, wrong one. I'm gonna take this and then put a red stud on it and then just put it in the hole. So it looks like that. Next, take a piece like this again and put it on top. Take four of these arm pieces, just like for the Spider Droid D1, and then four arm pieces. And put them together. And then you want to take the legs and attach them on the ends of those pieces. Here's one side. And There's the other side. So it just stand like that. Then next no, what do you want to do next? No, no, okay. You wanna take a piece like this with two with two of these pieces clicked on. And a piece like this again with one of these flat pieces like that. And you wanna take them, you wanna take one of these pieces call it a motor piece because it has like those three yeah see those three things right there you want to set it upside down like that and attach them like this then the two pegs here you want to attach them on the bottom these two holes here I'm oh, sorry these two holes here all right attach onto it then you swing this one forward then you're going to take a piece like this two by three flat attach one of them attach one notch on like that take one of these pieces on and just attach it on like that two of them on that's it for that side the arm out take a piece like this and attach it on top of here I did that wrong. Hang on. Leave yours the way it is. I put mine on the wrong way. I'm supposed to put the two piece one side out. Leave yours the way it is. Okay. Then you want to take a piece like this and attach it in there. Yeah. You want to put a piece like this this on top of here like that right here take an antenna piece attach on like that then finally you want to take the bottom of a rocket piece one of these pieces with one of those knobs right there in it 
and then one of these like fuel caps I guess you can call it fuel cap goes on top of the knob knob goes on top of the rocket bottom and then you just attach it on and there is your spider droid D2 that's how to build it now finally the turret it's the spider droid okay whoa almost lost the camera you're gonna want to take a flat piece like this. It could be anything. Just make sure that it's, that it's bigger than any rotating piece you have. Get the piece on. There we go. Make sure it can rotate. Next, you want to take two flat pieces and put them onto the sides. So you have these two in the end. Take these. Take two of these type of pieces and attach them on. Then you want to take one of these pieces and one of this. Attach this one on over here. Attach this one on over here. Then you want to take. You want to take. A do a uh, thing of this with two holes. Set it here. Take two of these and put them in the hole. You want to take a piece like this. Take a flat piece, gray, light gray, square has to be square, and then a dark gray flat and put it on. Looks like that. Attach it under there. Then you want to put a circ. Just put a. I have a circle piece there. You can put whatever you want there. But it has to be a you know, one by two big. And then take a piece like that with a cross in the middle. And then last step, take a light gray stud and a piece like this. Attach the stud on like to there, and then just slide it in. Put your finger there until you feel it. Then just let it go. There you go. Here's your turret. So yeah, in this video you have made my custom turret from Star Wars Battlefront. I'm not sure if I mentioned that. It's supposed to be the turret in the game. And then my spider droid D2. So when you build this or any of those, um, tell me how they turned out, if you like them or not. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time.